If you've got your multiplication tables absolutely burnt into your nervous system, many SAT questions can and really should be solved in your head. Like this one, where 88 over 8 is just 11. Or in this one, where 28 over 7 is 4 and 8 times 4 is 32. Or finally in this one, where if you know your quadratic formula well, you'll recognize that the answer choices are all in the form minus b plus the square root of b squared minus 4ac, all over 2a. So we can just calculate those components one at a time, eliminating answer choices as we go. Minus b is minus minus 3, which is 3, so we can eliminate answers c and d within 5 seconds, and we're down to two answer choices already. Now we just need to calculate 3 squared minus 4 times 1 times 1, which is 9 minus 4, which gives 5. So the answer is just A. Yes, you can solve this question with Desmos too, but it's pretty awkward because the answer choices aren't regular numbers, they're surds. So to see which option matches your Desmos solution, you're going to have to type the answer choices into your calculator until you find one that matches. And all that could easily take you over a minute, which is way longer than the mental calculations we performed earlier, which took about 20 seconds.